Hello everyone, welcome to another Funko Pop unboxing video. Today I'll be unboxing Lars Ulrich from Metallica. He is the drummer, of course, from Metallica. Um, these are brand new pops that Funko has made of all four members. Now they all look like they're younger versions, of course, from the 80s. Aside from Robert uh, Trujillo, I think that's how you pronounce his last name. Um, he obviously joined the band much later. I think it was back in like 2003 or something like that. Early 2000s. So, aside from him, they're all the younger 80s versions. So, Lars actually has hair. <laughs> That's the joke. Me and my friends make that joke a lot because uh, we're all Metallica fans. Um, and I actually went to their concert last month. It was a very good concert. Uh, we always joke that Lars never has hair because he's old. But uh, he has hair. <laughs> In this uh, format, at least. Um, kind of a generic pop. He's just kind of, you know, doing whatever. He's just got his drumsticks out. Aside from, you know, these other three guys, they all got guitars out. I think Rob looks the coolest. I can't wait to get a hold of him. Um, I already do have James Hetfield. Um, I might as well grab him. I will uh, compare the two once he's out of the box. But I do want to find these guys. I haven't seen them in person yet, but obviously I have these two now. So, that's Lars right there. Number 58 in the Rocks line. And what other bands would you like to see get made into uh, Funko form? Um, personally, I would like to see Led Zeppelin. That'd be a good idea, right? Led Zeppelin, maybe Pink Floyd. They don't have to do every single member, but you know, like the main ones, Roger Waters, Led Zeppelin they could do. Well, they could probably do all four for Led Zeppelin. Um, there's only four members. Whereas Pink Floyd has had uh, several, several members over the years, I think. Alright, here is Lars Ulrich. Drumsticks out. Pretty basic. Yeah, very basic actually. He has like no designs or anything on his clothes. Um, the only thing that's different about him, he's got drumsticks in his hand. There's his hair. There's the face, of course. I could rotate. You could do some sort of, I don't know. He's gonna drum you to death. Be with some sticks. His legs are, I don't know, he's kind of posing. I don't know, very basic. But uh, here he is with James Hetfield. So, and I believe these two guys are like day one Metallica. Like Kirk Hammett, uh, Kurt Hammett, or is it Kirk or Kurt? I always forget if it's Kurt or Kirk. Hold on a minute. Kirk Hammett, there you go. Kirk Hammett. I don't think he was in Metallica from the very first day. You know what I mean? I think he joined maybe a year or two after they started or something like that. Um, but these two guys, I know for sure, were there day one. Uh, they formed the band together, I know that. Um, so, pretty cool to have them in their young versions. I definitely like James, he James Hetfield better. Uh, he's got a guitar and everything. He looks a lot better. Um, but Lars is still cool. You know, he sticks his tongue out. Maybe they should have him sticking his tongue out. That would have been funny. Um, but yeah, he sticks his tongue out, tongue out a lot when he's playing live. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, thanks for watching this. Let me know what you guys think of him. And once I get a hold of the other two members, I will do unboxings for them. Uh, hopefully I can find them pretty easy, so we'll have to see. Anyways, thanks for watching this, and have a good one. Bye-bye.